So, you want to know what Sword World is and how to play it? Then this video will help you. Welcome to Sword World! What is Sword World 2.5? Sword World 2.5 is a Japanese TTRPG created in 2018. It is the successor to Sword World 2.0 and, by extension, Sword World RPG, the game's first edition. It is one of the most popular TTRPGs in Japan and was only available in Japanese until recently. Thanks to the Sword World fan translation project, this has changed. You can find its subreddit in the video description. Now, you can get the core rulebooks as well as a majority of the supplement books in English. How to play To play Sword World 2.5, you will need, at the very least, Core Rulebook 1, a pair of six-sided dice, and character sheets. Core Rulebook 1 contains all the necessary rules to play with from 1st to 6th level. Note, Core Rulebooks 2 and 3 add more additional and optional rules, classes, and races, as well as bring the level cap up to the 15th level. For the rest of this video, you will occasionally see this notation at the corner of the screen. It will tell you the page, as well as the book, in which you can find more information about the topic being discussed. With that said, let's delve into the game system itself. Classes Sword World 2.5 utilizes a flexible class system where players can purchase class levels using XP. Classes can be understood as different skill sets that you can acquire for your character. These are split into two categories, major classes and minor classes. Which group they belong to denotes how much XP you need to level that particular class. Major classes are more expensive in terms of XP, however, they will be more impactful to your character. On the other hand, Minor classes offer smaller bonuses and abilities without requiring as much XP. As you can imagine, Sword World is built around multi-classing. You can still create a solo class character, but having only one class will make your character a one-trick pony. Picking up a suite of classes to round out your character's abilities is vital. Sword World 2.5 features numerous classes across its books. For instance, the Major Fighter class enhances a character's accuracy and damage with melee weapons. The Major Sorcerer class grants the ability to cast Arcane Magic. In contrast, the Minor Scout class specializes in stealth, trap setting, and general thief skills. As of now, there are 21 unique classes found throughout the various books. For a more detailed look at all the classes, you can check out our class guide. Roles and Checks as previously mentioned, Sword World 2.5 uses a pair of six-sided dice for almost all rolls in the game. Skill checks, attack checks, and damage checks are all rolled in this manner. In fact, the entire game only uses six-sided dice. To roll any given check, you simply roll 2d6 and add your appropriate class level and ability score modifier to get the check result. Sword World also uses the power table to tune weapons and spell damage. There are 101 rows in the power table, each corresponding to some power value from 0 to 100. You roll 2d6 and consult with the table to see the converted result. Suppose you roll equal to or higher than the critical threshold. In that case, a critical occurs, and you can roll again to add it to the total result. Combat Sword World 2.5 features three combat systems, each building onto the previous one, Simplified, Standard, and Advanced. The Simplified Combat system is introduced in Core Rulebook 1. In Simplified Combat, players engage in battles on a map divided into three distinct areas, the Rear Guard, Front Line, and Enemy Rear Guard. You can think of it as early Final Fantasy Combat. Core Rulebook 2 introduces the Standard Combat system. Standard Combat is played on a line, similar to 2D fighting games. Lastly, the Advanced Combat System, introduced in the Epic Treasury Supplement, utilizes a gridless 2D battlefield, although it can also easily be played on a grid if desired. All three build onto each other, each using the same core mechanics and principles. As you switch from Simplified to Standard to Advanced, you gain more and more strategic depth to play with. You can easily switch between the three systems using each when it feels most appropriate. For more details on the differences between the three, see our video about combat systems. 
World. Raxia is the setting for Sword World 2.5. The world of Raxia was created by three magical swords, Lumiere, Ignis, and Cardia. Mortals who touched these swords became the first ancient gods. Raxia is home to many unique races, such as the rabbit-like tabbits and the artificial runefolk. The world has more than 10,000 years of history, split into four significant periods. There is the ancient divine civilization period, where gods walked Raxia. Then there is the magic civilization period, of powerful wizard kings and demons. The Magitech civilization period, when a fusion of magic and technology allowed ordinary people to gain access to things like artificial lighting and guns. And lastly, the present period, the Age of Adventure. At the heart of the setting lies the conflict between two groups of races, the humanoids and the barbarous. After the previous civilization fell at the hands of a barbarous uprising, humanoids are now trying to rebuild society as they fight to reclaim the land that has been taken by the chaotic barbarous hordes. This struggle is less a fight between good and evil and more a fight between order versus chaos, a struggle between two ways of life inherently incompatible. Each of the previous civilizations ended because of some calamity, leaving ruins behind for brave adventurers to explore and reclaim. Players take the role of these adventurers. For more details about the world, see our lore playlist. What is next? You can jump into the world of Raxia right away with Core Rulebook 1. It holds all the basic rules you need to get started. Players can use the sample characters provided in the Core Rulebook to quickly start playing. Just print and play. Alternatively, you can follow the detailed creation rules to create your own unique player character. There is a dungeon scenario in Core Rulebook 1 for new GMs, ready to play. You can also find many translated scenarios and campaigns for both Sword World 2.5 and 2.0 that can be used with the Core Rulebooks as is. Also, please check out our playlist that reviews all translated campaigns. You can either play on the Alframe Continent from 2.5 or the Terrestrial Continent from 2.0. Essential information about them can be found in their respective core rulebooks. You may also want to check out our video on how to create your first scenario. Feel free to visit our subreddit or Discord server for more info about the system. Links in the description. Thanks for watching! The Sword World Translation Project is a fan based, non profit translation. Sword World is owned by Group SNE and Kadokawa. Please support the official release. All the Sword World books can be found on Bookwalker, links in the description below.